Hi, everybody. For the first time in the history of IU basketball, the women's program ranks second in the country, but their goals are much higher than being ranked number two. As the Hoosiers get ready for the next big game against fifth-ranked Iowa, they took a moment of practice to enjoy their success. They've climbed the mountain to become a serious contender for a national title. Being ranked second in the country is a big deal. I mean, it's, you know, something that, um, I'm not sure it was a goal of ours, but any time that uh, people on the outside appreciate the work you're doing, uh, it's special. There's only one player on this team who grew up in Indiana. Sydney Parrish went to Hamilton Southeastern and was Miss Basketball in 2020. She transferred from Oregon to IU this year. Oh, it's more than I could have ever asked. It's so much fun with these girls and this staff and just being home in Indiana again, it's been amazing. Parrish is averaging 14 points a game, but she's more than a scorer. They call her the fixer who can take care of a lot of issues on the court. You know, when you have as many accolades as as Sid has had, uh, you know, you wonder when you come to a team that's already established with the culture, how is she going to fit into things, right? Sydney and her teammates have created a special bond that pays off on the court as they work towards bigger goals. IU reached the Sweet 16 last year and the Elite Eight in 2021. Maybe this is the year they hang a banner. You know, our goal is to win a Big Ten championship here. We want to win a national championship. We feel like uh, we have all the pieces to do that. Um, and I think our kids believe that, and that's the most important thing. Yeah, it would mean everything. I mean, I came back here to win, and um, I think the staff and the team really wants to win too, and I think that that would mean, I mean, that's the end goal for us as championships, but it'd mean everything. The Hoosiers have won nine in a row, and with five games left before tournament time, IU is poised to make some noise in March. In Bloomington, I'm Dave Calabro, 13 News.